Hi guys, I want to show you the new um, LiDAR X ophthalmometer in the My Callback app. Tap this acquire scan and then you follow the prompt. So it should say to basically put the eye in focus, put the dot on the face, and then you hit this button here to start. It's going to show a box. Now you want to drag the box to basically incorporate the eyes um, and the um, orbital rim. Now again, it's much easier when you're doing it uh, with somebody else, but I can pretty much incorporate it all here. Then when you have the, the box covering the, the eyes and the orbital rim, you follow the instructions and basically you just scan the face Okay, and now I only got 10, but I tap, tap to finish. It'll prompt you if you want to take uh, inferior photos as well, which I would recommend, but for this demonstration, I'm just going to click finish. And then you'll see it starts to render a 3D model. This uh, will give you an estimate of for how long it takes. It'll usually say a minute, but uh, usually only takes 20 to 30 seconds. If you take more images, uh, it takes a longer time to load, but the accuracy is definitely better that way. So you'll see now it saved it. So I tap OK. Now uh, it gives me the option to take another scan, but I'm going to close that. And then you tap Obtain Measurement from Scan. You put in the pupillary distance. Now this is to calibrate the measurements. You can measure that with a ruler here on the side, or you can tap Measure with True Depth Camera. And then using the True Depth Camera, you can find the PD. So the PD for me is 64, that's perfect. So I type 64 here and tap continue. And then I find the model. Now all the models, you can uh, see a preview in the thumbnail and you can also search for them. But this is the one that was just created. So I'll tap this. And then this is um, my 3D model. And it was just created uh, using that scan. And then you follow the instructions. So you tap the right uh, corneal apex, and then you tap the left corneal apex, and then you tap the right orbital rim, and again, this is not great because I had to do this as a selfie, but you can see it gives me uh, measurements, and if you tap save, it will then save your results into your camera roll. Um, if you want to share a model as well, um, if you go back to this, um, you can swipe here and rename models, share models, um, whatever you want to do, um, it's available to you. Thank you, uh, and I hope you find this interesting.